Hello and welcome back to European Officialis 4 Oriental Pirates with myself, Mustaboos, and Zatelier. Hello. And in between, we kind of realized that we are probably going to get a lot of this shit going on right now. Like, Portugal just declared and uh, probably won a lot in the West. I'm not, I actually haven't seen, but oh my god, mm. he just took over most of California from you. I mean, I didn't have California, but Cascadia, he took a fair chunk. Oh, Cascadia even. Well, shit. And uh, I feel like Spain will be next. Like, hey, uh, I kind of like this land and it's now mine. Like, Quite this is going to be next. Yeah. yeah. We are not fighting right now, are we? No. No, not right now. Go speed three then for a bit. Okay, I need 190 to build any ships, and I need 230 to build the heavies. Ish. Uh, oh, I got an army, there. Alright. Am I still making money? Yes, yes. I'm slowly Just... trying to catch up in tech. I'm currently 17, 17, and 16. Uh, 16, 16, 17 for me. But yeah, minus 20% right now. Oof. Regrettable. That's the thing, you can barely ever get like a 666 unless you want to drop your uh, tradition, your Republic yeah. Yeah, your Republican tradition, like, oof. It's harsh. Who's this? Oh, it's Majahapi trying to raid. Ah, oh, fine. You do you. Ah, okay, that's not good. VJ just declared me their rival. Oh. You're actually closer than Portugal, so... Mm. Mm. Okay, move to mysticism for a bit. Oh, I can't afford that. F for the bloody hell. Well, on the price of this, uh, manufacturers is already 40% in one of my provinces. Plus, I still likes me. They gave me money. Don't know why. Oh yeah, I do know why. I never raided them, because I couldn't, because they're being my ally forever. <laughs> uh, let's see. Um, that's the other problem with an island nation. You can't really build more than five ships. You know what? I'm going to change this template. Yes. Create a template for five. Save. Five. See, now I can actually do five ships at once here and five ships at once here. Oh, lovely. The ships in that were supposed to be raiding in gearing decided to not do the raiding. Oh. Speaking of which, I should probably start raiding you, etc. But that would mean taking my raiding fleet out of the Cape, which is currently my biggest income. Of course, I could just raid with my transports. Let's see if that works. Oh, it does work. Oh wow, yeah, that does work. Hmm. Excellent. There we go, that's a bit of money. I might be able to pay off another loan. Okay, this manual raiding, doing it with my bricks, I'm cool with that. Yeah. Oh wow, 105 ducats from UA. Thank you! <laughs> Yeah, I got 114 out of Liang. Chebu likes me, but they're threatened with by me. They would like an alliance, though. I will offer it. Just about. Okay, I can't raid you now anymore. That's fine. It's just an OPM, so that won't really change my life all that much. Oh, uh, Bengal has some rebels. Pigu separatists. Well, that's your problem. <clears throat> that's a whole lot of none of my business. I'm actually going to try to keep my spy network in Japan up for the time being, because it's going to help me getting the text. Colonial Cascadia is now Portuguese. Uh, uh, uh. Funny joke, that. Pretty sure there's a lot of Japanese people walking around there. Quite a few, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's 
read some more. Right, Mujahapit. No, not Mujahapit. Uh, VJ, I'm gonna rate your course as well if you don't mind. Well, they might mind, but you know. Yeah. I mean, I'm pretty sure that they do mind, but... Oh, I could actually rate the coast anyway from Bengal, but I don't take money, I only take slaves, apparently. Oh. Yeah. That's fine, though. Can I rate this area now? Is that close enough, or will that always be too far? Ah, uh, it's always too far. Okay. Right, let's sail to Yemen. Oh, right, I can probably start annexing my vessel here. I can indeed. Yeah, I did that earlier. Wait, they entered Kutai. Rebels. Entered Kutai. Portuguese rebel entered Kutai. Hang on. Uh, no. Cancel. Let's walk all the way around. Okay. Kutai oh, separatism. Oh, yeah. Oh. I'm gonna leave them to it. Because that would mean Kutai would respawn. Potentially. I'm cool with that. Uh, let's get a pirate again, even though I would love to have a higher level. I still need that Republican tradition up. Okay, you're an embezzler. Well, that's not great. Oh, you are such a rich nation sometimes. Hello. Hmm, delicious money. Right, let's put you on the raid fleet. Uh, on the uh, trade fleet, pirate fleet. There we go, that's the word. Raid that coast, 15 ducats. No, it's been raided? Oh, okay. Can I raid the, co the cape itself? I thought I could. Yes, I can. Hmm. Okay, um, hmm. That's no, I'm not going to touch there. I don't have the money to build more manufacturers either, so I'm kind of stuck here right now. Hmm. I have a fair amount of money for manufactories, however, is it spreading in my nation now? It is, by 1.44. So I'm going to leave it as is, as it is spreading. I'd rather save my money now for, uh, actually accepting the institution. Fair. Done that. Uh, don't want to do that. Do not want to become Defender of the Faith. Although I will be honest, getting one in Bhutan will give me a lot of ducats over time. Fuck it. How come the Ottoman turf is all of a sudden free again? Huh. Majahapadit has sown discontent amongst our population. Well, shit. That does not sound good. No, it's not. It's really not. And I've been... Ooh, order warships or order trade ships? Two galleons for zero of the cost. Three early frigates for zero of the cost and 50% of the time. I'm gonna go for the warships because they're quite expensive. Yeah, they are. Give me two heavies. Oh, Portugal is having troops here now. Oh, ooh. well, shit. Taking care of the rebellion. Yeah, taking care yeah, of the rebellion. And it's a 4612 leader as well. Huh. Oh, he just moved away. Okay. In Taglock, is that here? <gasps> oh, you fucking bastard. Okay. Can I tell you to invade that? Is that a possibility? Can I do that? Australia. Could you... Uh, 
Ah, uh, they don't have a truce. Uh, they have a truce, I mean. Ah. Guarantee profits. Pray for the best. No. Hey, I got a gain a victory card. Noise. It doesn't mean that I've done it, but it's just I gained the card. Okay, so they have one, two, three, four provinces. If they have one more province, it becomes a, pro a colonial nation. And then I can tell Palembang Australia to attack. Excellent. I will. Our truce with so has ended. Oh, wait. Did we have to break our alliance? Oh, um, I think we might have. Yeah, we did. We have annulled treaties until 1662. Well, shit. That's five more years. Oh. Okay, okay, I need to start I can get the Diplo 18. Let's see. I want you to have a regimental camp here. Uh, that's a colony you're building, that's good. And I want you to have training fields as well. Okay, where did you build your capital? Is that TV? Top end? What is the capital of... Oh, it's Baduk. Okay. So you need a fort. It's going to be expensive. That's all the money I have. But you need a fort on your capital, because I don't want them to waltz over you. Let me get a claim over there. Just getting some claims on Japan again. Hmm. Jesus. Because I fear that Japan... Uh, like taking out Japan might be the only way to fix my economy at this point. Mm. I like the Tondo. That's all you are. But what is your mil tech? Seventeen. Hmm. So Majapi is in the same boat as I am, for the most part. Tondo has lower military. Hmm. Okay, next year I can raid Japan again. Can't send a gift because I'm on nation ruining. Fuck, we didn't turn that off again. Yep. Uh, okay. Oh, I can get Seahawks. But I need my Diplo to. Ri yeah, I need my Diplo. Because I desperately need to get points as well. Yeah, I think the next uh, captain that I take. There we go, I'm gonna take the military guy because I need to get my military up in tech. <laughs> I need all to go up. Well, uh, yeah, but. Against Oof. I need especially military just to keep up so that I can beat down Japan. Mm hmm. Yeah. Ooh. That's a good one. Mauritius. Hmm. So yes, for once I'd say, Portugal, please make that province so I can start a colonial war. Yep, France is here. I knew that. It's worrisome, but it's true. That's two heavies. Lovely. That's a start. Oh. You have a few more armies than I expected you to have. Hmm. Let's attach to the ship and go back to the mainland. Oh, bollocks. Japan has military to 20 now. 
Oh god, that's the same as everybody else. Uh... Yeah, I got only 17. Yeah, same. Yeah, Brunei has 20, I don't know how. And they have manufactories and everything as well. What the fuck? I mean, to prepare manufacturers is almost present in one of my provinces. Yeah, it's getting there. It's just... Okay, I'm halfway through. So, 1662, when uh, our truce ends, I should also have manufactories, at least in my capital. Yeah, it's not in my capital, but it's going to be there in uh, about a year. Okay, do I go for a pirate, a smuggler, or I'm going to go for a dreaded captain for now. He's a bolt fighter, that's good. I need to put you on my pirate fleet again. Okay, what is this? Oh, money. what is that fleet you got there, Portugal? Hello. Is that your trade fleet? Looks like it. How are we doing on the... Hmm, I still got 60%. So that's good. Ah, excellent. That's a colony done. Manado. Very good. And another colony done. We almost have enough for more, for more trade power. Good. Alright, so I'm just raiding Japan. Hopefully I can pay off another loan after this. Hmm. Let's see. Is this 8th and... That really doesn't make a difference. Uh, let's go. Filipino minority. Um, let's send these guys. Because they're actually Sunni. Make that a core. Tungning wants Condottieri. Sorry, no. Right, I could... Uh, where is it? This is the harbor, right? Yes. Okay, a level 2 harbor. Excellent. And that is nice. a massive field. Um, where is it? Free trading ports. Yes. Trade efficiency plus 10%. Trade steering plus 10%. For the next 20, 25 years? 20 years. Portugal's opinion of Aungang is minus 40. Plausible deniability. Conducting any forms of attack on rifle ships in peacetime, whether through sanctioning reprisals or private wars, is covertly backing piracy has many benefits to us, but it's not without problems. One of our privateering operatives was recently compromised and the ships were crew captured. As luck would have it, they have lost their letter of mark, proving they work with our approval, and whatever proof connects them to us is purely circumstantial. As a last resort, the captain has now contacted us, hoping we will admit to our official backing so he can be used as leverage in the upcoming trial. So I'm either going to lose 20% of my privateering efficiency or Portugal hates me more. I don't think they can hate me more. So there's these are legitimate merchants retaliating against foreign aggression. So uh, I'm going to support the hardliners as well. And I got Pirate Monopoly. Huzzah. Right, so I managed to grab a few more ducats out of uh, these horse lords around here. What a colony. Ooh, and that colony got a boost on all three levels. Sweet! And I got military 18. Also very sweet. Leather cannon. Now that's... I always feel that's a step back, but sure. <laughs> that's excellent. Uh, you guys move over here. Uh, how much is these? This is 5k and there's 1k here. So let's split them tunk tunk and I'll select this, move them over here and start colonizing this. And let's do Moroccans. Yes. Wow. That might well be another three for that province. New Zealand is going to get real fucking rich. I haven't actually paid ah, attention. And oh, yeah. All Filipino provinces will get minus 2 unrest and plus 10 production for 10 years. 
Why, thank you. Oh, it's all the shit I got from Mindanguano, of course. That's all Filipino. And most of it is animist, which is a problem. Ah. That's a lot cheaper to convert. Excellent. Oh. Time, yeah, is fighting a rather big war over there. Mm, me. Uh, test your ships. Oh, let's just quickly desiege that. Uh, we should not ask what he can do for his run. Yeah, exactly. Right, how many? I still got quite a few loans. I still got seven, and now it's all together to 1100. Oof. I mean, I had to pay the Portuguese like 800, and oh, then I had God, just yeah. the the institution before the war happened. Hmm. Okay, let's desiege that province just because. Um. So no, it's not present anywhere. Okay, excellent. Right, you are built. You can go here. Time to build another trade fleet here and here. Okay, that's 10 traders who can privateer in. I suppose I could just split the army here, so it's avoiding most of the attrition at least. Ooh, the Malakas in Australia. Now go for the Malakas. Privateer in the Malakas, that's fine. Right, so I'm gonna need another idea group. Yeah, I will go military in the next one, I have to. Even though I haven't even put a single point in the Diplo one for ages. Yeah, I think... Hmm. Guys are, well, actually kind of useless now, so... I think I'm going to take the maritime ideas. It's going to let me build quite a big navy. Mm, that's the one thing I already have, the maritime ideas. Yep, uh, I still got two points in that to uh, spend. Seahawks and naval fighting instruction, though... Oof. Plus 25% privateer efficiency, again. Oh yeah, it's, that would be yeah, nice. It's, pr it's pretty potent. Okay, so lie. now I'm uh, flat 18 on the technology front. Oh, that's a good one, yeah. And of these colors. There's another. Oh, oh. Japan is having a bit of a corruption problem because their research is quite unbalanced. They got 16, 19, and 20. Oh, God, yeah, that's. That's an imbalance right there. Pirate seeking allegiance. Uh, private ESC. Oh, yes, please. Plus 20% pirate steering. Oh, yep. Yep, yep, yep. More privateering. All the yeps. <laughs> okay, I can build quite a bit. Oh, I can actually upgrade a lot of my marketplaces to trade depots once I have money for that. Which I don't right now. Oh, no, I need Diplotech. That's why. Wait, does that mean that I have a vessel who still has... Oh! Oh! Hang on. 17, 18, 19. Jesus, my my vessel is stronger than me. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Okay. I was doing so well till... I'm gonna say Miltech 15-ish. Well, somewhere around there, yeah. But now, oof. I think I'm gonna start spending some... Uh, uh, yeah, I'm gonna spend some uh, Republican tradition on keeping this guy alive. Okay, 
you're not a great sailor, but at least you're doing your job here. Oh, oh fish! <laughs> Balls. Oh, I actually cannot really raid anywhere right now. How's Betsy Maraca looking? Oh, they got Miltech 16. Oh my god, no, no, fuck. Oh, what? Betsy Maraca has become a vassal of the Ottomans. Ooh. Uh, goodbye Zanzibar, goodbye plans there. Oh, wow. I'm happy about the Ming explosion, but now, Zen uh, now the Ottomans are going nuts again. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but we yes. are actually out of time. Uh, okay, just one thing. A uh, brilliant Portuguese inventor from Portugal seeks our patronage after falling out with the kingdom. Diego de Crasso has been described as one of the great minds of his age, producing many mechanical and chemical inventions beyond the understanding of most others. So I can take him in, uh, piss off Spain, Portugal, Brunei, Colima, and Potiguara, or I could risk not angering Portugal. I think I've been well past that point, so I'll take in Diego de Castro for that one point of innovativeness. And we'll say, say thank you all for watching, don't forget to like, subscribe and comment, also check out the other players' perspectives. All the links are down below, including the links to our Twitch, Patreon and Discord pages. Now I need a breath, and I'll say goodbye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.